as Ethernet technology is deployed in more and more carrier networks. The standard VLAN defined in IEEE A02.1Q alone cannot completely distinguish between and isolate a large number of users. The A02.1Q in A02.1Q technology is developed to solve this problem. The QNQ technology improves VLAN utilization by adding another A02.1Q tag to a packet that carries an A02.1Q tag. In this case, the number of VLANs can be 4096 by 4096. As the Metro Ethernet grows and a greater diversity of services are deployed, two tags of QNQ can be applied in more scenarios, that is QNQ VLAN and stacking VLAN. In QNQ VLAN, the private network VLAN tag is encapsulated in public network VLAN tag. In this case, a packet carries two VLAN tags to traverse the carrier's public network. In the public network, a packet is a transmitted based on its outer VLAN tag. Its private network VLAN tag is transmitted as the packet data. The QNQ VLAN based private line service can achieve the interconnection and secure communication among branches in different areas within the enterprise private network. Let's see an example. An enterprise HQ and branches are located in different areas. Department A has employees in both the HQ and the branches, and they have letters exchanged between these offices. Letter exchange needs help of department called reception room, which works as a public network over communications network. When department A sends a letter, the reception department identifies the marked destination, enterprise branch and department A, and then accurately and securely sends it to this address. In stacking VLAN, the outer tag indicates the carrier, while the inner tag indicates the user. In a layer 2 switched metropolitan area network, there are multiple internet service providers. To provision the services provided by the ISP to the specified user group rapidly, the outer VLAN tags of VLAN stacking can be used to identify ISPs, while the inner VLAN tags to identify users. In this way, different user groups can be connected to specified ISPs in batches through different outer VLAN tags to obtain services from the ISPs.